Hey, what's up guys? It's Lando. Welcome back to another reaction video. And today we're going to be reacting to my man, my boy's Killer Taken in um, his debut EP, which is also known as Scared and Anxious. Um, this came out like a week ago, but um, I have yet to um, listen to it yet. So um, that's what we're going to be doing in uh, today's video. So this project is pretty short. It's only 8 songs and 17 minutes. Um, um, the longest song on here runs um, up to 3 minutes and 15 seconds. Um, this cover art, I, I actually made this cover art, um, I made his cover art for his, um, Three From Hell song, too. Um, it's not the best cover art, I know it's gonna come off as really ugly to a lot of people, but, um, but I still think it, like, gives the message, or, like, gives a understanding on, like, what the record is about, and that's all that matters to me, you know? It doesn't really, I don't really think it really matters, like, if it's ugly or not, you know? As long as, like, it gives, like people like an understanding of like what the record is, is about then I'm, I'm chilling like the brain like shattering into fragments you know that's kind of like that's kind of like inspired by like thoughts i've had before when i've like had bad anxiety you know like my brain my brain feels like it's like shattering or whatever you know i've had that thought sometimes so that's kind of like where that came from um the paper and the cover art, like the second piece of paper in the cover art, that's um that was made by aiden that's his handwriting and shit you know in the uh paper you can see it says anxious and scared and shit so you know that pretty much comes from the, you know that's you know what the thing ended up being called like and shit like that you know you know i think i think this was originally supposed to be called this project was supposed to be originally supposed to be called anxiety that's why that's why i have anxiety on like on the cover art but i guess that's just not what ended up being called it called but that's fine i don't really care but um so as far as the track list goes um the first track is an intro there um um there's features on five out of eight songs on here um featuring features from 3am Ludi pop i think that's how you say his name and um xcon like 3am is featured on three songs on here and Ludi pop is featured on two like Um, I would prefer that they were solo tracks more, mainly because this is like a, a, I guess his debut EP, you know, I would prefer it if they were just solo tracks more, but it's all, it's fine, it doesn't really matter, but. So, without further ado, let's, uh, let's get into this, I'm excited to listen to this. Um, my expectations aren't that high, but, but I still anticipate this, so, um, let's, uh, kick the things off with this intro. This is gonna be completely off the top of the head, it's not written down or anything. And I was like, I want to make a whole EP. And so I decided to make a whole EP. Uh -huh. EP. Everything else on this, though, has a lot of meaning between heartbreak. Um, and I hope you guys like it. I put a lot of work into it. I'm sure you did, my guy. Yeah. So that was the so that was the intro. I guess that was just him, like, explaining how, how the record is, I guess, you know. You know, I've seen that before, you know, and shit like that. So, um. But according to him, every song on here sounds different. There's no song here that sounds like the other, which, you know, I like. Apparently, none of this shit was written down, apparently. It was just all freestyled, I guess, which is, um, which is, a uh, pretty interesting to hear. I wonder how that will, um, feel. Is that the right word to use, feel? On the songs on this record? Um, but anyway, um, we're gonna go on to the first track, if you don't count the intro as one, but, um, this track is called From the Mud. This is the one they said he made for fun. Um, this features 3 a.m. Um, so uh, give this one a listen. Sounds like it's gonna go really fucking hard. I like that sample. I thought I was gonna drop there. She was a slug, smashing her up like a bug. Smashing her up like a bug, using her blood. I, I forgot what he said, but one of the lines on there made me laugh. <laughs> no, this is pretty. This is pretty all right so far. Gotta love the whispering. I am rising from the mud. You can love it, you don't. Yeah, I'm shit for fun. Damn. This man is just destroying his throat. So that was. So that was from the mud. Um, I personally enjoyed. 3 a.m.'s performance more than Killer Taken's, but Killer Taken's performance wasn't that bad. You know. Um, I don't really got much else to say about it, you know, it's, it's the one he said that he would do for fun, you know, and when it's a song that's done for fun, you usually don't have much to say about it, do you? Um, I'm excited to ne listen to this next one, though, because this one features XCON, this one's called I Hate Myself. XCON made a song called, um, Suicide Asylum, which is a song that I really liked, um, 
I still like, you know. Um, so, um, I'm excited to listen to this one. Um, let's, uh, let's give this song a shot. We got the Shiloh Dynasty sample. Always good. Trapped, I want to get into music, but I feel like I can't even rap by some monotone. Like, who the fuck want to listen to that? The fuck, I want to listen to it, dude. Fuck it. I want to listen to it. I'm listening to it right now, bro. Fuck. Judge a kid that lost his mother. I'm a piece of shit. Should kill myself or just slip my wrist. Slip my wrist. Always talk about slip my Yikes. Shit. Damn. So. I don't even know. For yourself. You don't have to kill yourself to realize living's killer be taken. I'm with killer taken. We cooking like bacon. Wow. <laughs> I knew this record was gonna be depressing, but I didn't think it would be. <laughs> Maybe I'm over exaggerating. Maybe I'm like over exaggerating in this shit, but. Damn, son. Jesus Christ, man. Chill. Now, I wish I could say more, but these songs don't really give me that much to say. I mean, I like XCOM's feature, you know. I like the Shiloh Dynasty sample in there, you know, and shit like that. So, um. Um, again, I think. I liked XCON's feature on there more than Killer Taken's performance on there, I guess. Um, I just, I don't know, it's just, you know, um, I like I like the song better than From the Mud, but I know, it's just like one of those moments where I think I'd rather listen to XCON's part rather than Killer Taken's, you know. Um, I mean, I don't mean any disrespect, of course, I'm just, you know, I'm just saying, you know, I gotta be honest, you know, so. Um, but anyway, we go on to the longest song on the, um, the... Uh, the uh, project so sad featuring Ludi Pop and 3 AM um again. So um <clears throat> let's uh um let's uh give this song a listen. What is this sample man? I like it. And see how you can change hey, your it's song toward nothing. So you have my back new when you left me you oh, man. attacks me why aren't we the move on but you're glad I'm pausing this because I really you know I like it but I just know I don't got I don't really got anything to say about it. I mean it's just like maybe I just don't got a lot to say about man because I just already know what every song here is about already before I even listen to them but you know but you know it's you know it's a song it's about you know a relationship that didn't work out obviously there's not really much I can say about like what, what the hell else am I supposed to say about it but I mean this is, this is pretty all right so far you know um, but you know I haven't finished the song yet, so let's uh, continue listening. And I just love the sample, man. The sample is so common. Was it really so hard for you to see? It's like time is moving so slow. Time and time is moving fast as shit, dude. I don't know what the hell you're talking about. <laughs> for me, anyway. So that was so sad. You know that was all right. You know, it wasn't anything amazing or anything like that. Um. Not sure if I like that more than I hate myself or not. Um, so far, I, I, the beat the beat choices are pretty um, are definitely good so far. I definitely like that. You know, um, I just you know I wish there was more of. I wish Kiro Taken did more on that track. You know, I just felt like his um, the amount of him on that track, you know, was just a little like too small. So, um, I feel like he could have maybe had more appear appearance on that track. So, um, um, again, it's another song that was, again, carried by features. <laughs> so, I mean, again, I'm gonna say this for the final time, I mean no disrespect from that. I got to be honest. So, you know, I'm not trying to be an asshole or anything. But, I don't lie, so. <laughs> Anyways. Next song, Broke My Trust. I think I heard a snippet of this. I don't remember how it sounds, though. This one features Ludi Pop again. Um, <clears throat> so, um, let's give this one a shot. Alone in bed, staring at my ceiling fan. Why? Every day, man. It's something I do every day. I just sit on my bed. <laughs> well, I don't have a fan, but... Well, I have a fan right behind me, but it's not a ceiling fan, but... Um, I mean, I, I can relate to that, I guess, you know, even though I'm not always sad when I do that, but, you know, I'm more, like, tired, 
a shit, but can't fall asleep. <laughs> I want to die cause you broke my trust. I gave you love, but you gave me lust. I don't know how, I don't know why. Every set inside, all I ask is. I like these harmonies, dude. This is fire, dude. I like it. <laughs> Bro, that was that was fire, dude. I like that one. <laughs> I like that one. Um, you know, I liked I liked the chorus on it. That was good. I like that. Definitely one of the more better songs in here for sure. Um, you know, Louis Pop performance was great. You know, I liked Killer Taken's performance on this too. Um, this one was not carried by the feature, you know. But anyway, this ne this next track is the title track and it's an interlude. Um, I'm gonna guess this is gonna the instrumental. This is gonna be like piano or something. It's just, it's just a guess, though. I, I don't know what it's going to sound like, but... Wait, 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 I find out. And I was right. <laughs> Almost every day. Scars on my wrist. This is just sad, man. I don't right? feel any ripex in this world. It's slutty sunny. And little people. I like that he gave a naughty slutty sunny. Rest in peace, Jordan. That was very... <laughs> that was sad as fuck, dude. Shit. <laughs> Well, it wasn't sad as fuck, but it was sad. But... I, I should probably also make something clear real quick that, good or bad, Killer Taken's not lying on any of these songs. Like, he's not lying. Like, good or bad, everything on this project is the truth. Like, like, like this is shit, like, he went through. And, like, I know this because I saw it happen, so... Like, I like I know this dude. Like, I've known this dude for the past, like, two years of my life. Like, I've known him since, like, November of 2018, so, like, I've... Like, I, I, I've seen a lot of, like, his ups and downs and shit, so, like, I know, like, I know for a fact that he's not lying on any of the, on, like, any of this shit, so, um, like, like, this shit is, like, you know, like, in the intro, he said that none of this was, like, written and shit, so, this shit is, you know, coming from his heart, obviously, so, um, you know, I, I, and, and I like that because, it, you know, it gives more a, more of a raw feeling, so, um, you know, I, you know, um, that's why, you know, I can, um, give so much more credit to this record even if the music on it is not the best in the world you know i can still give it that credit you know so um anyways um we'll move on to the second to last track which is called stressed out featuring 3 a.m again this sounds like it's gonna be aggressive i like that flow dude yeah, man, nobody's having fun right now. It's like fucking pandemic going on. We're all just bored of shit. We're all trapped in our fucking bedrooms, just you know, making music in our bedrooms. Not me, obviously, since I don't really make music anymore. So, um, I mean, there's nothing else better to do. So, but yeah, not wrong about that. You know, I don't think anybody in this fucking world has fu had had fun in a while. <laughs> I told you. I'm okay when I'm really not okay. You make me feel like I'm insane. Am I insane? Am I insane? We're all going insane, dude. Sign lyrical miracle. Hope she gets hit by the front of a vehicle. <laughs> Fuck. That one was decent. You know, not one of my favorites, but um, I don't really got much to say about that song. I guess you know, wasn't that bad. I guess wasn't that bad, but no, it's not one of my favorites. But anyway, um. Let's uh, move on to the final track, which is Anxiety with Three Eyes. The fuck? Is there going to be like a part in the song where he goes, Anxiety? I don't know, but we, we got to find out. Man, I just love these beats, man. I love these samples and shit, bro. Beat choice, man. Good. You cry all the time, yeah. Anxiety's a time. Cut in my wrist, contemplating suicide. Yeesh! But a virus should have been sterilized. I'm so tired of all the fucking lies. It's like your obsession was to see me cry, but I can't decide. Fuck all them bitches, man. Fuck all them bitches. Yeah, that song was okay. No, that wasn't. No, that wasn't really the ending that I wanted. But you know, it was alright. Um, um, I, I, I felt like he was a little offbeat towards the end a little bit when he was doing like the little more fast rap, and I couldn't help but think he was a little more, a little offbeat. Um, but that's fine, I guess. Um. But, um, that's the the end of the project. Um, my favorite songs on here. Um, I really I enjoyed "Broke My Trust." Um, the X contract was pretty neat. Um, um, so sad was alright. Um, and the from from the mud was 
decent. Um, the last two, t two tracks, I that didn't really fuck with them, to be honest. Um, I didn't really feel them, those two tracks, to be honest. But overall, this isn't really anything amazing or anything. Um, again, there's not really much I can really say about this record, because, you know... Again, there are some cuts on here that, you know, I think you guys should, you guys should, should go check out, you know. I mean, if you want to listen to the whole project, I will leave a link down in the description like I always do. It's on Spotify as well. Um, I don't know if it's on Apple Music or not, but um, it's on YouTube, SoundCloud, I think, also. Um, you know, but, you know, if you have Spotify, I encourage you to listen to it on there so, you know, you can support my friend, you know. You know, because it's, you know, it's, it's what he likes doing, so. Um, but other than that, I don't really got much else to say. Um... Also, before I go, I'm going to say this right now that, um, speaking of Kill Taken, he has a song coming out on the 26th called, um, Dead Dreams, and, um, I actually made the cover art for that song, too, again, um, that song's coming out on the 20, I think it's the 26th, so, there you go, get some little free promotion for the song comes out, you're welcome, um, but yeah, I don't really got much to say, um, I will see you guys in the, uh, the next video, bye-bye.